Hey Tubes, we're back at it again. We're working on that 520 LXI Toro wheel horse. Has an engine that was also in a John Deere. I believe it was a 445 tractor as well. But they were notorious for uh, that cam gear going bad in them because they had a plastic gear. Uh, my tractor started acting up, lost oil pressure, so we took it apart. And this is part two of this tear down. We got the engine up here and we did find our culprit right here you can see the teeth are missing off that oil pump plastic gear uh, they did have out on the web I saw a steel gear replacement uh, everything else looks pretty good we took the inside apart and come to find out somebody has already replaced this steel gear in here uh, I didn't have any notes on that nobody said anything and so I figured it had to be replaced eventually well somebody replaced it and did not replace any of the gaskets on this thing so that's why it started leaking oil all over it as you can tell how filthy and dirty this engine is got oil all down the sides it collected dirt and I knew I was gonna have to take it apart put new gaskets on definitely but I knew, figured I'd have to do that gear replacement but to our surprise when we took it apart Voila, steel gear. So we won't have to replace that. Not going to have to spend as much. I thought I was going to have to do a video on replacement of that cam gear, but we saved that. But overall, the tractor, uh, it took a little while to get it out, but we did pretty good. And as we looked up on the inside, the uh, inside of this engine doesn't look too bad. I already took a flashlight, shined it up inside the cylinder walls. You can't see from this footage here, but the inside looks really good. We're going to take the top end apart, check out the valves, make sure all those still look good. Um, take a closer look at a few more components, configure, you know, figure out what we're going to really need to buy. But right now it's looking like we're just going to have to get some gaskets and a new oil pump gear and go from there. But I really thought I was going to have to do a longer video on this engine and a complete tear down and removal. But to our surprise, we found a steel gear. So... Hopefully that was our only issue on that oil pump from what we can see. Hope you enjoy the video. Comment, like, uh, send questions if you guys have them. Hopefully I can answer them.